Hey everyone, welcome. Have you heard about the hamster man? <laughs> Have you heard about the hamster wheel attempt at the Atlantic? Anyone? Anyone? <laughs> And I do believe that we have rock, rock, rock dicks, and I'm, I'm not using that as an exaggeration. Well, this gentleman, if you see him there, we'll just call him Hamster Wheel Harry, <laughs> has actually been trying to get across a sea, an ocean, in a hamster wheel. That's effectively what it is. It floats on the side in a cage with him in the middle. And what has actually happened, he's been arrested <laughs> for trying to cross the ocean and has been banned from going anywhere near the ocean as a result. Now, I did have a look into this because it, it struck me originally as what would we have been have said to, say, the first flight across the Atlantic or the first solo yachting around the world? or on any of these other groundbreaking achievements that humans have made, would we have been the same then? Because he's only trying to break some sort of a record, isn't he? He's only trying to do an endurance thing. Or oh, that's what I thought. But it turns out it's a little bit deeper than that. <laughs> he's a little bit nuts, this guy. What's actually happened is he's been pulled over by the Coast Guard 70 nautical miles off Georgia, off Tybee Island. They've tried to pull him and have a word with him and asked him to, re to, to come out of the cage. And what he's actually done he's told them he's got a 10 inch knife and he'll kill himself if they force him out of the hamster wheel and when that didn't work he, t he told them he'd got a bomb <laughs> Christ. Now this guy's called Rezare Baluchi, Baluchini, Baluchi, and he's an, <laughs> he's an Iranian athlete and activist who lives in the US. <laughs> now this happened on September the 1st, and he was spotted, like I say, 70 nautical miles off Georgia by the Coast Guard. When ordered, he went to immediate, <laughs> I'm going to top myself, and when that didn't work, he's going to he's going to blow himself up. So I think the restricting him from going near the sea is quite a, a viable option, and it isn't what I thought just trying to stop an adventurer. So I thought I'd bring it to you because it's quite entertaining, isn't it? Let me know what you think. <laughs> I'd like to know your opinion. I think maybe they should have just escorted him. <laughs> what do you think? Stay sane. I'll see you on the next one.